So, without further ado, let's meet today's teams. Oh, woof, woof, woof. Our team is called the Squirrels. Oh, woof. <laughs> oh, woof, woof. We are the Acorn Heads. We're the reigning champions. Mm -hmm. And please welcome our resident brain, Ladybug. Hello. Let's start our quick fire first round. Oh, woof, woof. Oh, woof. <gasps> a lawnmower. Correct. Oh, woof, woof. A transient state of being. Oh, woof, woof, woof. Me? Oh, woof, woof. Oh, woof, woof. The bee's knees. Potato. B minus E plus F equals two. A slice of cheese. Correct. At the end of that round, the score is 3-4 to the acorn heads. Yes! On to round two. Oh, woof! In whose house is this mouse? First team to tell me whose house this is wins the round. The owner of this house is clearly a badge guy. He's obviously got a big appetite. And watch out, ladies, he's a guy in uniform. <gasps> it's Dougie's house. Oh, yeah. Look, there's Enid. Huh? Mouse! Correct. Making it four points each. All right, squirrels. If you're going cow wrangling, you'll need... A wolf. A wrangler's hat. A wolf. Boots. Wolf. A good shirt. A wolf. And, of course, a horse. <laughs> well, howdy doody. We got ourselves some real cow hands here. A wolf. And Dougie's got the supplies. Roll out, partners! Yee-haw! Yee-haw! Woof, woof! Now, the first thing a cowhand's got to do is look. You see? Hoof prints. They bend this way. Next thing is, a cowhand's got to listen. Wait! Can you hear them? Yeah? That away! I'm thirsty. <sighs> ah, cactus water. Some cows, but them cows are gone. Cows are gone. Follow them cows to a land so far. Land so far. Lost me them cows. Oh, boo hoo. Boo hoo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Hey, Dougie, what you doing? Oh, woof. Knitting? A wolf? Dougie said knitting was one of his favourite things. Uh, what's a favourite? Luckily, Dougie had his favourite badge. A wolf! Ooh. And he explained all about it. He's very good at explaining. A wolf, 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 wolf. He said it's something you really like more than anything else. Oh, woof, 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 woof. And everyone has a favourite something. What's your favourite thing? I don't know. There's so much to choose from. Then... Dougie had an idea. He said to help us decide, we should ask everybody else what their favourite thing is. So we did. Testing! Testing! Working! Working! 
What's my favourite thing? Big question, man. Should I powder his nose? Achoo! Never mind. Hmm. Peace. Yeah. Peace is my favourite thing, man. I thought he'd say carrots. What's my favourite thing? Well, it's easy. It's Nigel. My favourite thing? Hmm. I'll have to think about that. A clear order and rapid response. Quick march! What's my favourite thing? Is the volume okay? Yes. Mid 90s ambient music! Now, squirrels, you'll all be getting a wolf clippers. And it's important to be safe. So, what are the rules when using them? Always hold them by their handles. That's right, Betty. Um, keep them closed when you're not using them? Correct. Hold them down by your side. Good one, Tag. Don't run with them! Very important, Roly. Wear a helmet? I think if we follow all the other rules, we should be safe, Happy. A woof! Woof! So, with your clippers and bushes, you can start small with tiny snips. Take your time. And you might be able to do a ball just as good as Dougie's. Oh, woof! Can we only do balls? Oh, no. There are lots of shapes you can make. It's got 18 sides. Gosh, the squirrels seem to be naturals at this, Dougie. Woof! Let's do some more! Yay! I think I can work with this. Small is beautiful. What to do with you? Yay! Woof, woof, woof. We are the singing squirrels. Yeah! Oh, woof, a woof, a woof, woof, woof. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and. Huh? <clears throat> oh my! Hot cheap as well. This is gonna be amazing. Your a cappella badge. Yay! What are we doing next, Your Majesty? Whatever you want. Yay! Yay! Watch out for the tower!
did some rather gnarly kickflips, didn't we? Yes, but my corns are killing me. A good old soak in the bath is what you need, dear. <gasps> Everything all right in there, Dougie? Oh. <gasps> Would you look at that? Oh, very nice job, Dougie. But glad we didn't pay you by the hour. Ooh. Aww, I think King Tiger's tired. Mm. Have a little lie down. You can borrow my blankets. Oh, cosy. And drink some nice warm milk. It had been a long day, and the little king was very tired. Oh, woof, woof! Shh! King Tiger's just dropped off. <laughs> oh, jelly belly dancers. Oh, woof, woof, woof! Detective Puppy is really good at looking for clues. Yeah, she found a blue handprint. Is that a good clue, Dougie? Woof! Yes, everyone has different handprints. So if Detective Puppy finds out whose it is, she'll find out... Who's been naughty? Oh, woof, 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 woof. Could it be Detective Puppy's arch nemesis? Shelly, the turtle? Or Mumbles, the fly? Or was it Fluffy, the cat burglar? Look, Detective Puppy knows who did it. Who, who, who? Well, in the comic it says... Woof, woof. To be continued. Where? In the next issue, of course. Oh, uh, woof. What? what? There isn't one. A oh, woof woof. They stopped making Detective Puppy comics. Why? Well, tastes changed. People didn't want detective stories anymore. They wanted comics that were more action packed, fantastical, futuristic, and shiny. But I really want to know who took the necklace. A oh, woof woof woof. Excellent idea, Dougie. Maybe you could finish the story yourselves. But how do we make a comic? Ah, Dougie can show you, because he has... his comic badge. Yay! Woof! To make our detective puppy comic... Oh, woof, woof! We first need to work out who took the necklace. Hmm. Now try smelling this lavender tag. It smells flowery. Whoa. Take a deep sniff. What does it smell like now? It smells so sweet and smooth. Like I'm floating around a peaceful, misty mountain. Oh. Ah! Dougie's homemade banana bread. How does it taste, Nori? Yeah, it's okay. Huh? Maybe take another bite and really savor it. Oh. What can you taste now? I can taste sweet banana, something nutty, creamy butter, and. And what can you hear, Rudy? Nothing! A woof! What about if you listen really carefully? <gasps> I hear the leaves talking. Now I hear little bubbles and the flapping of tiny wings. 
Oh, would you keep it down, please? Sorry. Good listening, Rudy. <laughs> we love using our senses. Are there any more? Well, there is a sixth sense. Which Dougie developed after mastering all the other five. It's called the Dougie sense, which enables him... <laughs> to keep you safe. Ha! Wow! In the first roleplay, Dougie will pretend to be Alan. Sergeant Ant? Yes? Alan has arrived late at your house for tea, and you want to find out why. Enter! A woof woof! No excuses for lateness, Alan! Insubordination! One hundred press-ups! Thank you, Sergeant Ant, but I, I wonder if there's a better way of dealing with Alan's tardiness. I have an idea. Come in. Hello, Alan. You're a bit late. Is everything OK? Oh, woof, woof. Oh, I can't tie my shoelaces either. Shall we find someone to show us? Very diplomatic tag. And you helped solve Alan's problem. Sugar-coated nonsense. Not a press-up in sight. Now, Nori is going to play Letitia, who has a ball. Roly will play Ace, who would like a go with it. Give me the ball! No. Oh? Might there be a more diplomatic way of asking for it? Could I have a go with your ball, please? Yes. Much better. Humph, <laughs> wishy-washy. Now your turn, Betty. Happy is Fabrizio, a customer at your cafe. And you're Lucy, who's brought Fabrizio a delicious meal. Voila! One cheese and cucumber banquet. Bleh. Oh, dear. Fabrizio doesn't like cucumber. It's not bleh, is it? Fabrizio isn't going to do what you say, Lucy. How could you deal with this diplomatically? One moment, please, customer. No cucumber. Thanks. Excellent role playing. So, what would you like to know about me? Anything. Well, I don't like mess. Nor do I. So I see. Do you love dancing? Not really, my thing. Do you go in the water when you're kayaking? No. The kayak goes in the water, and you go on the kayak. Hmm. No, thank you. I'm looking for a bird watching buddy. Oh, I try to stay clear of birds. You'll probably think what I'm looking for is ridiculous. <laughs> you're right. It is ridiculous. I like doing experiments. Did you know if you put cheese? In I know all about cheese. Table swap, Dougie. <laughs> I'm looking for a kayak buddy. Splendid! What's a kayak? It's a little wobbly boat. Superb! That you speed down rapid rivers in. Brilliant! Fancy it? No! I like cleanliness. Me! Too! I'm looking for a bird! <laughs> Watching buddy. Do you like water? Orf, 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 orf. <gasps> Dougie. I like order. And I like my numbers. Next. <laughs> you might think it's ridiculous, but I just want to have big adventures. How do mind-blowing stunts sound? <gasps> Amazing! Where is the chair? Shame my kayak isn't bigger. <laughs> The buddy bonanza's working, Dougie. Hmm. Oh, woof, woof. You're right, Dougie. Sounds like large-scale seismic instability. Whatever it was, it was the best thing that ever happened. Yes. Who would want to share a rock with that lot? Thinking they're so fancy with their juicy pears. Ooh, like they're not so, so shiny. Don't you get tired of shouting at each other? 
What else would we do? You could make Blurgen again. It would be nice to have something other than nuts. They say it tastes like the first day of summer. But how can we make it? We are so far apart. We need to bring them together. We need to <gasps> build bridges. Or just one? Yes, and Dougie can help. A wolf. He has his bridge badge. Yay! <laughs> of John and Nigel's house. A wolf! And this pepper pot represents Nigel. While Nigel is in the bathroom, we will assemble outside at exactly 12.11. When is 12.11? A wolf! When it says it on your watch. It says it on your watch? Oh, wait. You don't know how to tell the time, do you? No! Well, Dougie can show you. He has his telling time badge. A woof! You see, on a watch, the big numbers from 1 to 12 are the hours in the day. And the little numbers are the minutes in each hour. What are the arrow things? They're called hands. The small hand points to what hour it is. 12! And the long hand points to what minute? Ten! Oh, woof! You've cracked it! <laughs> now listen very carefully. At that time, we will all be outside John's house synchronising our watches. Does everyone remember the plan? Yes! At exactly 12.15, when Nigel is in the bathroom, John will let Nori and I into the house. Where we'll sneak down the hallway with the decorations. At 12.29, while Nigel is loudly eating his muesli, I will lead lost lobster doors <laughs> into the living room. Then at 12.45 precisely, Rolly will ring the doorbell. In disguise! Delivery! Meanwhile, I will enter with party food and sneak into the kitchen, followed silently by Dougie. <laughs> oh, woof, woof. Now the second shortest, please. That's definitely me. You're not out of shoes, but you haven't had your growth spurts yet. Yes, that your shoe size. Size. I'm I'm not. Not. I think you might have to help them, Dougie. Oh, woof. with the tallest at the back. And shortest at the front! Ah, you were listening! 
the beat. Another puzzle! A musical one! We have to stand on the same colours that came on above the door. The first one was green. <laughs> then it was blue. <laughs> then it was red. <laughs> Ew, cream cheese! Betty, I think you'll find it's yellow. Pink. Red. Oh. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> How many more puzzles are there? Oh, many more squirrels. <laughs> <laughs> Well done, squirrels. You have completed all our puzzles. You may take your prize. Yeah! It says here that mythical creatures are amazing animals with special powers, like the dragon, who can breathe fire. Wow. Or Medusa. Who turns anyone who looks at her? Who are you staring at? Into stone! Ooh! Some mythical creatures were a combination of different animals, like the centaur, who has hooves and hands. Yeah! Or the mermaid, an enchanting creature of sea and land. <laughs> Some people think so. What other mythical creatures are there? A wolf. There's the unicorn. The most beautiful mythical creature. I really am. Oh. The werewolf. La Bella Luna. The sphinx. No. The griffin. Too weak. Dooms. <laughs> Trolls. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, and... Oh, there's nothing here. <gasps> Maybe we can make up our own mythical creature. How about a dog? Huh? And giraffe! A dog giraffe. Is that a mythical creature? Uh, oh. What about a fish? Now you're a giraffe fish! <laughs> And cow. <laughs> and bird. Cowbird. No, cow gerbil. Would you like to watch your soap opera? <coughs> On our TV? Oof. Please enjoy the season finale of... The <laughs> Agony and Ecstasy. Dr Maria. Dr. Pedro, 
Nurse Juan, Carlos, and Nurse Gloria. <laughs> Previously on Agony and Ecstasy. I have to go, Nurse Juan. There are eggs out there that need my help. Don't go. Boo-hoo-hoo. -hoo. What's wrong, Nurse Juan? Dr. Maria has gone forever. Oh, goody. Now I'm in charge. Happy, it's your turn. I, um... <laughs> oh, dear. Happy has stage fright. Remember what Dougie taught you. Oh, woof, woof. Yes, the soap actor must show real feeling. Oh. So imagine there's lots of water. Water! Now imagine there is none. <gasps> water! Bravo! Real feeling, but why? Okay. Because no one can stop me now. No! More eggs to be hatched. We no longer hatch eggs in this hospital. Why? Because under new hospital legislation as specified in paragraph 60, it clearly states now all departmental decisions concerning Ready? Yes! Then it's time to play Planet Zap! Captain Happy, you roll first. Okay. You now all need to move three species. One, two, three! <laughs> You've landed. Oh no, on Javuvian space slime. <gasps> what shall we do? Oh, off. look at your character cards to see what items you could use. For instance, Roly, you have a jetpack. Do I? Yes. If Roly spends five learning points to get a fuel marble, he can spin it in the space collider to power the jetpack and get away. Uh, okay. You just need to land on purple. It worked! You can move two spaces away and get 12 learning points. One, two! You have reached the Dothraganians. They look like babies. Angry babies. They need a nap. Huh? My mum says I need one when I get irritable. Then I'll play a lullaby. Um, what does it say about music in the rule book, Dougie? Oh, woof, woof, woof. Oh, so if you roll 30 plus on a 32 sided dice, self generated musical objectives can succeed. 31. Oh, success. All of the Dothracadians have fallen asleep. And you can now journey to the next location where, oh dear, a giant space monster lives. <laughs> its deafening roar shakes the very ground you walk on. It's hungry. Really? Yes. That's the noise my dad makes before dinner. You should feed it, Betty. You're the space chef. Um, is that in the rules, Dougie? Yum! You like raisins, don't you, space monster? Um, is, is, is that in the rules? Let's go there next. On this. Is that in the rules, Dougie? Did we maybe go a little too far north, Dougie? Oh, woof, woof. Ah, so we just need to go east a touch. But which way's east? There are no trees to tell us. Well, squirrels, animals can also help you find a direction. A wolf. Animals like... Whoa! Migrating boing-boing fish. Excuse me, fish. Where are you going? We're going to a party. Part of a jazz macchiato. Shower down dumpster. My techno event, actually. Where is it? East, of course. Where all the best pies are, sweetie. <gasps> East is that way. Oh. <laughs> Too far east, Dougie. Oh, uh, woof, woof. Of course. We just need to head a little further south now. But which way is south? Donkey! Huh? Lobster! Uh, no. I'm a crocodile. Not you! The clouds drifting on the southern winds. You see? That one looks like a tractor. It looks more like a slug wearing a hat. But if the clouds move south, then we should follow them. 
further west, maybe. But how can we find our way in the dark? Oh, woof woof. By using the stars. Wow. When you need something, grow something. It's made from potatoes. Oof. So potatoy. Oh yes, very rugged. Oh, you'll love mine. It's called you. Don't be what they expect. Don't be what they want. Don't be what they say. You. Try it, Dougie. Oof. Yes. What's in it, Nori? Honey, green carnations, and chestnut shells. Hmm. Well, what do you think, Dougie? Oof. Yes. Empowering, isn't it? Well, I made this one. Water. It's certainly watery. Mine's called Sachet. For the rhino who likes to have fun. <laughs> Don't just go with the flow. Mm. Oh, hiya! Hiya! Be the flow. Live your best life. Sachet, I be. Hello, squirrels. What are you doing? We're seeing how many badges Dougie has. Five. Six. Se huh? What's this one? That's Dougie's counting badge. He got it for counting to 100. 100? Oh, woof. But that's impossible. Oh, woof. It's a challenge, squirrels, but not impossible. If you can count to 10. I can. Then counting to 100 is just counting to 10, 10 times. Really? Oh, woof. Can we try? Yes. Let's start by counting up to ten. But what should we count? Anything that's around you. Uh, one. Good start, Tag. Two. A wolf. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. We did it. <laughs> we counted to ten. Wolf. Now you count the next ten, this time up to twenty. But we've counted everything here. Then let's go to... A wolf! <gasps> the kitchen! Eleven, twelve... Um... Ah, now we're entering the teens. Uh, they can be a bit tricky. A wolf, wolf! Now you're in the twenties. Oh, woof! So, start with twenty... Hello, Dougie! <laughs> Remember me? Oh, woof! Gosh, you've grown, Mo. By 356%. Ah, <laughs> still love numbers, I see. Yes, I'm an accountant now. Oh, he's very good. He does all the finances for me repair shop. Oh, woof, woof. <laughs> I broke so many things I thought I should learn how to fix them. Fixed anything interesting or mysterious? Oh, and Pip is a reporter. Aha, still asking questions. And are you still taking risks, Nala? No, I minimise them. I'm in risk management. Oh, financial or operational? Statistical covariance. Statistics, love them. 
They don't sound like squirrels. They sound <gasps> like our parents. Does that mean when we're bigger, we'll be like our parents too? Will I always do things in a minute? Mom! In a minute! Mom! In a minute! Mom! In a minute, Tom! But where are my shoes? And I'll need to concentrate! Truly, I need to concentrate! Oh, am I going to really like tea? Ah, perfect cup. Will I look forward to sitting down? I've been looking forward to this all day. And will I dance like my dad? Oh, yes. He's got a very good beat. Beat, beat, beat. Hello. We're squirrels too. Just like you. In a minute. In a minute. We're going to have some fun. We're going to play games and dance. Dance? Really use your imagination. My club hat is going to have lots of twirls. And wavy lines. Oh, how art nouveau. Mine is full of straight lines and angles. Oh, how Bauhaus. Mine's going to be... Ooh, nice! How delightfully modern, Dag. Fish, 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 fish! Very brutalist, Rolly. Thanks! And what are you doing, Happy? Water! Of course. Finish! Well done, Squirrels. It's going to be tricky to pick just one of these designs to build. But we want to build all of them. Oh, what? Um, it's a rather ambitious design. You said we could do anything. Oh, uh, woof woof? Uh, yes, it's well over regulation height for this kind of area. But you said we should use our imagination. Uh, the, the budget for the blocks alone would be... It's our dream clubhouse. Oh, uh, woof. Very well. Your plans have been approved. Let construction begin. Oh, woof. First, a good building needs... <laughs> ...and... ...a solid foundation. Quality control. Structural integrity. Accurate measuring. Safety in the workplace. Good fixtures and fittings. And some quality finishing. Wow! Doesn't it look amazing, Dougie? Woof! We were playing with our toys. And you said... I wonder what Dougie has planned for you today. Yay! <laughs> Dougie was giving King Tiger a box of old things. These will be perfect for my sovereign summer sale. It's to raise money for a bigger crown. To a sale once <laughs> with my cousin Eric, who found a spork, which is a cross between a fork and a spoon. Happy, does this have anything to do with what happened today? No, but it's a good story. Oh, I'm sure it is, but it's very important to stick to the point, otherwise, it gets confusing. Oh. Let's return to what happened today. After King Tiger left, we asked Dougie, What are we doing today? Oh, woof, woof. He said we were going to do something from the Squirrel Club handbook, but he couldn't find it. <gasps> Dougie had dropped it into the box he gave King Tiger. Oh no! So he chased after him and got the book back! Yay! Wait a minute. That's not the whole story, surely. Tell me everything that happened after you went to look for King Tiger. We got to his palace and there were so many things for sale. Try it out for size. It's excellent for hibernating. Hi, King Tiger. Was there a book in the box Dougie gave you? Why, yes. Can we have it back, please? 
No! I've already given the book to Wu. She's in charge of the Summer Sale Library. Library? You see, you don't need to be all bam, bam, crash to be a hero. But what if you need to destroy things? Or rescue your friends? Or save the city? There are other ways to solve problems, Squirrels. For example, you could save the city by... Dancing! Oh, woof! But Jeff's not really dressed for dancing. I'm sure we could find him something else to wear. Yay! <laughs> Ooh! Jet would love this. And this. And these match his eyes. <laughs> he looks much more fun. Yeah, he's ready to dance. <laughs> hey! <laughs> I'd like to see you bust. Yes, we could give Jet a new voice. Something softer. Like he cares about how people are feeling. Jet, you gotta hide. Jet doesn't hide <laughs> from his emotions. <laughs> so, tell me how you feel. I'm just so angry all the time. <laughs> there, there, let it all out. Jet. So compassionate. What else can he be? Really good at maths. Maths? Yes. It's very useful when you're zooming through space. Get your headed straight for the asteroids. Don't worry. I can calculate the clear path through because I'm good at math. Radiance per second. Interrupted trajectories. Diminished fuel equals... Control. When I walk, I own the road. I'm fierce. My look is bold. I'm elegant. So I am the queen of style. You know what to do. Strut, glide, take it step by step. And there's more, much more. You can stomp like me. Stomp, stomp, get the like me. Tip, stomp. Hop like us. Hop, hop, shuffle like us. Shuffle, shuffle. You can circles. Much like us. We're marching. Open, stomping, sashaying, waddling, trotting, scuttling, striding. We're taking it. Just time for one more thing. Tuggy hug! Oh. Tuggy.